Ladies and gentlemen, we have a situation more commonly known as a problem. As you can see here, Jebediah is stuck. More stuck than he was before. Let me explain what I did, okay? I was testing out some stuff before I actually hit record, and uh, long story short, I got him stuck. Look, I didn't know you couldn't revert launch once you switched to a different ship, so... Eh. He has no capsule, no more EVA propellant, and he is falling. Jeb is in a suborbital velocity. I don't know exactly how. Something I did when I was trying to get him to a different ship. He is falling, and we have eight days to save him. If we cannot rendezvous and get him onto our ship within eight days, he will enter the upper atmosphere and he will burn alive. Ladies and gentlemen, the stakes have never been higher. So the plan today is we're gonna rescue him. So as you can see here, obviously suborbital trajectory. Here's his periaps, 61,000. We can't do anything to change that. He is going to fall and within eight days of, of curb and time, he will die. But what I need to do is I actually need to wait a little bit and get him around here. If I can get Jeb hovering above the Kerbal Space Center, what it means is that the rocket that I launch, they'll be really close together and I won't have to do as much maneuvering. That was the biggest problem. That's why I waited so many days uh, my first attempt at this. Ladies and gentlemen, take a look at the launch pad today. We have the beautiful Olympus 11. Yes, the Olympus 11 is just a retrofitted Atlas 1, but it, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We are just trying to rescue Jeb today. And who's going to rescue Jeb but Ferris Kerman. Ferris is our newest pilot. We brought him on as a, as, a, as a newest member because we need somebody with SAS capabilities to be able to do this launch successfully. Come on and boom. Okay, let's push him a little further ahead. Boom. Right there is where I want Jebediah to be, right above the Space Center. And we, we don't have time to waste. We got to go. So let's throttle up. SAS is on. We're a go for launch, baby. Look, orbiting has become so easy. I have tried this so many times. I've just been doing a lot of testing uh, and stuff. So we're gonna be a little behind him. So we're gonna have to keep a lower orbit so we can catch up with him. But this is much better than what I had before, where he was he was on the other side of the planet, basically, by the time I was getting up into orbit. I like to push the apoaps a little bit. Some people say it's not good. You know, I, I, I actually found I, I like pushing the apoaps a little bit. Don't judge me. Don't question me. Don't question my authority. I like pushing the apoaps. Oh, watch this. Okay, so see, these are coming in close right here. So what we'll probably want to do is wait an orbital cycle. And while we do that, we're going to come here, add a maneuver, and we're going to pull these in. See how they're crisscross applesauce like that? We need to bring them in so that they're kind of on line with one another. See, and that's actually pulled them in a little bit. So that's good for our purposes. So let's go ahead and we're going to warp to that maneuver. We should, after we go around this cycle... We should see that orange section get closer. Or maybe the purple section. Whichever one gets closest, we're going to take. So where's Jeb? So we're actually ahead of Jeb. If we were smart about this, we could also come here and maybe pull these out a little bit. Oh, wait, look at that. Look at that. Okay, boom. So if I actually do this in one maneuver node, we can do this. Intersect within 14.4 kilometers. Can you believe it? Well, we'll be fine. As long as we can get close to him and start pointing at him, we'll be fine. Okay, so let's start burning in three, two, one, burn. Oh, out of fuel on that one. Grab the second canister, we're fine, we're fine. And cut. Perfect. That's good. Okay, so now we are on a trajectory to be within 14.9 kilometers of Jebediah. So once we're there, we basically need to find Jeb. So let's go ahead and bump forward to that. Let's watch, let's watch us rotate. We rotating around. So all we're really gonna need to do is, is there a maneuver I can do like, it's gonna help bring us closer on that? If I like sink this in. Let's have, okay, that's a good one right there. So let's make that burn. It's just gonna help bring us in a little bit. We're, look, look, it's about orbital turns. We're not really worried about fuel. We're not worried about how many burns we're making. We're worried about how many orbits we have to make. And that's not good if we have to make orbits. Don't want to make orbits. That's only a four second burn. We'll be fine. Cut. All right. Good enough. Good enough. What's our intersect? 6.7. 6.7. Okay. So once we get there, watch this. This is crazy. So look. Oh, we're coming in close. We're coming in close. And here's how we can find Jeb on the map. If I'm not mistaken, it's a four. There he is. Jeb and I are Kerbin. How about that? Okay. So now what I want to do is I want to point at Jeb. See, he's moving a little bit. So I want to point at him and thrust. Get going about... That ain't too bad. So now what I want to do is actually burn against him. 
So I don't want to. Ooh, 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 this is not good. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. Retrograde. Retrograde. Go retrograde. Go retrograde. If I can get to retrograde, if I can get it to focus in on retrograde, we'll be fine. Because then I can just do this, come down, and start burning against him. Okay, so now he's he's actually escaping me. So where are we? So we've kind of passed our uh, our maneuver there. So what I want to do? Shit, that's not good. All right, so we are coming in hot on him. Let's go retrograde real quick. See, our orbits are basically starting to line up. See how that works there? Um, which is not great, not the ideal situation, but it works. So if I just keep doing this, we're gonna get closer and closer as things go. Oh, we're getting close. See, I wanna get that number down to zero, essentially. Oh my God, that was perfect. Okay, so our orbits are basically in line at this point. Perfect. Not the most efficient way of doing it. Don't take this as a tutorial. It's not a tutorial. But we're going to burn towards Jeb at this point. See, now it's all about just soft burning. Really lightly burning, reserving fuel for other activities. Getting in line with him. I wish I had a target node. But you know what? Maybe Ferris, when he gets back, maybe he'll be able to earn the, the target node. Burn lightly towards Jeb at a safe 50 meters per second. The good news is our, 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 our prograde is online with our target, which is what we really want. So see, we're getting close to a meeting point, or we'll be less than 0.2 kilometers away from one another. If I keep doing this trajectory, and if I can slow down at the right time, then we'll be golden. We'll be so golden. I'm so excited to save Jeb. I'm a little terrified, though, because... Well, we've, we've done it in, in, in less than an hour. The reason I took eight days to do it is because I kept cycling around the planet so I could meet up with him. Um, but that was, a, that was a foolish errand. All right, here we go. Burn. Burn. Okay, now, point towards Jebby. And we're just gonna really lightly go, because we are very close. See that? Now, retrograde. So now, we're just rendezvousing with Jebby. We're rendezvousing and we're doing it! Oh, voice crack. Oh, Ferris, you're gonna be Jeb. It's gonna be great. Now, the only problem is that Jeb doesn't have fuel, so he can't move towards the capsule. So we gotta really try to move the capsule towards him. And hope to God he can catch on. Five meters per second. So you can actually see him now. Oh my God, you can actually see his little body. So let's burn towards him again, like we were doing before, like, like our... Like our grandma's taught us, burn towards Jeb. Like, I mean, we want to be going like two meters per second towards Jeb. There he is. Can you believe what I'm seeing here? It's insanity. So effectively, he's coming towards us. Now, if I, if I switch over to Jeb, the problem is, so if I, what if I swung? He's still, because he's still coming at us. What if I swung over here? And I'm thinking, the my best course of action right now, I think, is to try and catch Jeb on up tilt. I have to do a really soft burn, because we don't, again, we don't have those micro things. I'd have to do a really soft burn, like, right here. Okay, he is getting up there. So now I want to switch over to Jeb. It's F to grab. Oh, my God. F to grab. F to grab. F to grab or space to grab. Oh, my God. This is, like, this could not be more perfect. I can't even touch. I can't even rotate him. F to grab. Beat a board. Beat a board. Wait. F to grab. Wait, F to grab. Shit, 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 shit. Oh no, fuck. No, 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 we had it, we had it, but the fucker's still in the pod. Oh. Okay, so I've got him transferred out now. Oh my God, so can we switch to Jebby? Board, Jeb, board, Jeb, board it, board. I'm just gonna tap B. They're not, the problem is, yeah, they're not moving. See, that's the issue. Is he getting closer? He is getting closer. Just keep tapping B. Just keep tapping B to board. Just keep tapping B to board. Watch this. Oh my god, just keep tapping B to board. He's about to touch it. Jeb, Jeb, just just grab on. I can't- I see I have no control over him. Jeb, grab on. No, we've sent him, we've sent him. We 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 bumped him accidentally. B to board. No, wait, oh no, he's in the hatch still. Fuck. And they're moving away. Shit! Damn it! Damn it! Oh my god, he's stumbling. He's just stumbling and fumbling. Alright, burn fully retrograde. I want to get to a stop. Alright, here we go. Come on, come on, you bitch. Don't do this to me right now. We're just gonna go as slow as possible. Towards Jeb. Oh wait, no shit. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta move you out of the cockpit. Transfer crew quickly, 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 quickly. Oh my god, Jeb. 
Jeb, be okay. Just be okay. You know what I should do? I should- I shouldn't do that. I should- I should focus on getting the Olympus stopped right next to Jeb's head. Alright, I'll watch this. Go under him. Scoop him up. Just give him a scoop de scoop Oh my god, here we go. Wait, shit! Ah! I gotta move him out of the fucking thing! Fuck you, transfer crew, transfer back, hatch, tracking station, go! Go, Jeb, go! We got him! We've gotta get him this time! E, E, E to board. Be to board, F to grab, be to board, F to grab! Be to board, F to grab! Be to board! Jeb! Fuck, what is wrong with you? I can't flip him! Ah! All right, bitch. Come here. Come here, bitch. Wait, what? Why is he- why is he running? Why is he running? Why are you- why are you escaping? What? Oh my god! I tried. I really tried. I... I really, really tried. Thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe if you enjoyed, and also leave a comment down below telling us what you want to see next. But as always, my name is Daniel, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.